It's Moses Osawe's homecoming exhibition and has brought a blast from the past comic characters, which used to be your favorites in the 70s, back to life. The title of the exhibition is uh, Pat Johnson and Gabriel Cartoons. These are two cartoon characters I created several years back, and uh, most of my uh, storylines are based on uh, the exploits of these two cartoon characters. You know, I've used them for a very long time. I created them while I was with the Daily Times, through Vanguard newspaper and other publications, particularly Front Times. So they've been the protagonists of my cartoon stories. <laughs> It features about 72 paintings done by this veteran cartoonist who's been away from the shores of Nigeria but has been studying events keenly and that's why he was able to blend the old works with the new which talks about current societal issues. The intention is to show that cartoons can be a collector's item for keeps, not just for laughs. The impression people have about cartoon is that they are something to be read and discarded so this exhibition is about changing that notion. It's supposed to be something decorative, just like paintings. So the way you frame them, don't they look, don't they look good? So it's something you can hang and display on your wall. As it, the picture is entertaining, the words are also entertaining. So it's everything rolled into one, visually and uh, otherwise. It's entertaining all the way around. You can decorate, it's informing decorating and at the same time uh, you can now keep it instead of just reading and throwing it away. A lot of research went into putting this show together and now that Moses Osawe is back he's looking forward to keeping the campaign about having cartoons as a decorative piece alive. <laughs>